It happened at 1030 this morning as the F-16 fighter jet carrying an undisclosed number of missiles was taking off at Ellington. It skidded off the runway. A fire reported the pilot safely ejected, according to authorities, and was taken to an unidentified medical facility to be evaluated. These are pictures of the jet on the grass beside the runway, still intact, but the situation in Ellington far from over. 4,000 feet away, that way, off, off Highway 3. The airport evacuated of all non-essential personnel. The Houston Fire Department stood by on the tarmac. Firefighters suiting up the city's aviation department said it was because fuel was still on board the aircraft and the fighter jet was carrying munitions. The continental U.S. NORAD region clarified the concern. According to a spokesman, those missiles were air-to-air, -air, the plane and pilot on a training mission for Operation Noble Eagle, created after 9-11 as part of the air defense shield for the U.S. This whole area is getting evacuated. That's why the evacuation order was extended to areas along Highway 3 closest to the airport and runways. A portion of the East Beltway closed to traffic. HPD delivered the order to this business on Red Bluff at the Beltway to temporarily close in what they call the danger zone. That's the reason that we're, we're getting these businesses that are inside of a, a a predetermined area and uh, getting those um, everybody out of those areas, including this one right here. And that evacuation order stands. And again, crews are waiting for that fuel on board that F-16 to run out. And that may not happen for another three or four hours.